Hi, my name is Willix, and this is episode one of Grounded. Well, this is the release version that's been patched, not the pre-release version. And I'm going to deliberately show you a few tricks and tips in this. For instance, where to get the um, uh, la Larva Blade and the Ant Club. You can get those right away before you do much of anything. I'm going to collect a little bit of food just in case. I will probably make it through the first day without having to eat, but uh, who knows. And have we hit any sprigs yet? I don't think I have, actually. They're around, I just haven't uh, been paying attention, I think. Any water up in the trees? What the hell was that? That's just a pant. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was a spider already. I'm only in the beginning area. <laughs> but a red-eyed spider, it sort of freaked me out. Okay, we got at least one sprig, so that's fine. All right, so my first question when I did came up to one of these analyzing stations is, what do I analyze first and why? Well, what I would analyze first would be plant fiber. The reason I'd analyze the plant fiber is you want to get yourself up to woven fiber. You need woven fiber to do just about anything. So we'll escape out of here, and we will craft deliberately woven fiber right away. And then we'll escape out again, and then we will do an analysis, and now we will take woven fiber and do that next as our number two thing to do. And that gives us our sprig bow and our acorn shovel. And then, oh, I didn't need to get out. And a sap would be a good choice. I think you're going to pick a sprig. I, I used to, to deliberately take the pebble so I could get the axe, but you seem to get the axe whether you take the pebble or not. Okay, so we're going to kind of backtrack here a little bit, I guess. Uh, because we want to get sort of that cliff. See the cliff off to the left-hand side here? We want to get around that. And we'll come out over here, I guess. Extra spread. Ooh, water. Water, 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 water. And we'll just hit this. You went too far? I needed to kind of be standing underneath it. Now, where is the house? The house is there, so yeah, we're going to head kind of in this direction. And we're going to follow this little sort of path here. Along here. Oh, no. See that there? That log? We want to be on the other side of it. The reason we want to be on the other side of it is this side over here and on top of it has mites. And I don't feel like fighting them right now. Later on, I'll come back and kill them all. But for now, I don't want to get too close to that log. And they seem to run around on the other side of it. We'll follow this log as sort of our direction of where we're going. Oh, I know what I should probably craft. Let's craft a spear in case I get too close to that. Tools, pebble spear, craft. While we're here, let's craft a pebble axe as well. Oh, and let's equip the spear. Let's 
somewhere, yeah, right over there I can see it. So this is the apple. Can't do anything with the apple yet. Uh, mites are going to attack me when I go there. So let's first off come down here. No shortage of sprites there. So that was the, beside the apples was the hot dogs. Uh, you can see them over there. And this is the hot dog wrapper. And then there's a leaf beside it. And on, under the leaf is the rotten lava, larva blade. Keep wanting to say lava blade. Larva blade. Now let's come up towards here. Oh, uh, inventory. Let's put the... Right there. And we'll equip it. And this th now see we've got a a mite already coming to visit. I don't see any more mites. It's not the mites do all that much damage. I'm just more worried about them uh, swarming me and causing trouble that way. You can hear them. Analyze. Oh, I know what I would have liked to have analyzed. Clover. I didn't collect any clover. All right. Well, I'll analyze this thing for now. And I don't think that does much for us. I'm just analyzing whatever I've got on me. Okay, so we come back out along this way. We're going to continue along beside the log. Log's sort of pointing the way we want to go. Notice that we've got the little action figure over there. And then there is, we'll call it a lake, but really it's a puddle. <laughs> and we'll come along to our puddle. And we'll follow the puddle. Because over there, we got things like bombardier beetles and stuff like that. Oh, while we're here, you can actually use that uh, larva blade as a... So I don't forget it for next time. You can use the larva blade as an axe, actually. There's water there, but it is... Nah, it'll drop in the water. Oh well. We'll just follow around here. there. I wonder if if I punch this Sometimes I see them floating in the water. 
and I was wondering if it would mix with this water or whether it would float. And if it did end up in there, uh, it looks like it mixed. Either that or I just, I'll go back in editing and I'll look at it and go, oh, there it was, it was sitting on the bottom and I didn't notice it. Which is typical for me. I notice all sorts of things in editing after the fact. I'm not going back up. There's nuts all over the place here. Well, we should probably switch back to something like that. Yeah, I'm not chasing up to you. I've even got meat on me already. Okay, so this is the bird bath. We're passing from the little lake there, past the bird bath, and we're coming up to here. Now we want up on that cliff somehow. Now there may be a couple of different ways of getting up there, but I'm gonna climb up this little twig here. Actually, I don't know if there's any other ways to get up there, but I'm gonna use the twig. Hear those noises? There's spiders above us. Now, so we got up on top of the cliff, and there's a wall here. And we're gonna look for this little gap in the wall, just over here. Yeah, it's complaining that we're thirsty. Well, we're where we want to be, so I'm not. It's not going to be dark enough in here to matter that much. And heads. Over here, we have Rotten Ant Club. Um, actually, we probably have the stuff to make one. Why don't we make ourselves a. Have I not researched what I need to research? No, there it is. What are we missing? Oh, dry grass. Oh, I didn't get enough dry grass. Okay, we won't worry about that for now. So now we really need water. Whoop! <laughs> I was panicking! Wasn't paying attention to where uh, where I came off that. Okay. Do I want to go hunt down one of the fresh waters they're pointing me to? Or do I want to just drink this and eat my mushrooms? Or do I want to cook my gnat and uh, then do it? Yeah, you're up on the cliff, so you won't do it. What about this one over here? How are you? Are you gonna be something? Okay, so... I think you're gonna fall okay. So we will come over here and... Uh, I didn't don't want to use I don't want to chop you down to There we go. So now that over there Somewhere over here is Nat Island and we don't want to go to Nat Island. It's just covered in that. It's just covered in and I am going to come back this way. Oh, are we on that island? We might be, actually. Nope, that's Night Island. <laughs> We're now on it. I don't feel like hunting nuts forever.
Why is this clay in here? Well, maybe that, that might not have been part of that. But this lake is full of clay. Okay. And we'll deliberately come back out the way we came so that we can analyze again. What do we have to analyze? Here we got at least three things. That's fine. Now, which way is our little... Oh, there we are. Well, I'm not lost. There's our action figure. That's the action figure. Where is our log? Okay, I'm confused again. Spider webs. Why have I got this equipped instead of this? Oh, there's our log. Whoop. Especially when I see them coming like that. See, he told you it broke those things down. <laughs> Looks like an axe. Well, we're at the end of our log. Well, where is our... Oh, was it way back here? How did I end up over there? Way back here, might not have been worth it. I'm going to pass the other one in the sack. Unless this is a different log. Might be. I'm not going to continue that way. There's a thistle. Which thistle is that? Yeah, I definitely came out in a different spot. That was a different, totally different log. While we're here at the Thistle, let's uh, get ourselves... See, I've got to watch my water over on the left-hand side. Make sure it doesn't go too low while I'm doing this. That's why I'm not doing it faster. Thinking about the uh, 
Ant making noise around me. Ant with red eyes. If this is the one I think it is. This is the way out. Which leads over to this. Actually, let's do another analysis before we do anything else. So the analysis machine, this analysis machine is over here. So I did get turned around on my way back. What else is new? I should have started setting up some workers. Clover, that's something we definitely want. And so that I can show you some things on this one. So this gets us our clover armor. I want to be able to show you something on this. So let's make the other ant club. And... I don't get this finished off. I don't think it does anything for us now. But I wanted all that nice raw signs. It's beginning to get late. So let's get set up for the evening. to build a little temporary base, this is not my permanent base by any means, up on this rock. And so we're going to uh, utils, lean to, and Q to turn it, then left click, right click to end that, and hold E to build. Okay, that did that part. Um, the time is only 18.35. So, we can do some other stuff over here. Where are you? Mostly I want the mat fuzz. Okay. Mind you, I guess I could have hunted the uh, other guys. Um, craft. Let's make ourselves a uh, uh, meal prep, roasting spit. Oh, don't have enough dry grass. I don't really have time to run out and do that. Okay, so let's just show you this part of it. For instance, let's... Oh, one other thing. Craft, uh, tools, spiky sprig. Okay, so now, in our inventory, let's directly compare the uh, spear, which is here, to this thing here. So, notice that this does slightly more damage, the rod and lava blade, 
or larva blade than the spirit. Not much, and this adds poison, but the poison is minuscule. I actually like the spear about as much or better because it has better reach. What do I mean by that? Um, is it nighttime now? Nope, not yet. What do I mean by that? So let's say, for instance, I aimed at this portion of the rock here and I... Oh, no, I hit. Can't do it with that, but if we do it with the spear... Oh. Let's come over here. Okay, so I can hit that here, but if I use this one, I can't. So it does have better reach on the spear. Did I break the... Uh, I did. Can I craft a new one? Uh, well, utils. This thing really couldn't take much damage, could it? W to sleep. Okay. Oh, so I left a little gap there. Didn't know. Okay, and my... All my meat spoiled, of course. I know you're supposed to save this stuff, but uh, I'm not making the thing right now. And I don't want it in my base because that attracts ants. So I'm not going to be storing it in my base and I'm going to have too much stuff on me. Okay. Um, what was it? I oh, I need to dry. Oh, getting back to what I was talking about. So... The other thing I wanted to show you on inventory was comparing the sprig to the, where's the ant thingy? Where is the ant thingy? There it is. And why aren't you on my bar somewhere? And we'll put the, that on a four. Okay, so when we go up here and we compare this to that, there's very little damage difference at all. They look pretty much the same. Now, rotten, what does that mean? Is that a problem? Does it matter? What? If we go craft and we look at tools, and we know how to make the workbench gear, workbench tools. The ant club stuns all the way up speed and damage. Larva blade has poison. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know where what difference it makes at all. Like, larva blade, poison, all the way up there. Yeah, it looks pretty much the same to me. I'll have to double check it some more, but I don't see any difference to it. Let me know in the comments if there is a difference that you figured out on these things. Um, we're going to need food and water. So, did I kill any nuts tonight? No. Are there any nuts flying around? No. I'll go over here and get water first thing. No, I'm not messing with a ladybug yet. I heard something buzzing around my head.
Oh, that's it, Ladybug. Push my fluid out of the way. You do too? Yeah. Our food's not too bad. I won't worry about it yet. So we need dry grass. This will do just fine. as many as I expected. Usually with those you get a whole bunch of it. Oh well. Okay. Totally forget all the things I was thinking. Oh yeah, we were going to craft ourselves a uh, meal prep area. right now, but a gnat's going to come along to bug me in a sec. Then we're also going to craft a workbench. Whoop. A workbench is under utils. Oh, we need planks for that. Okay. Oh, and if we're going to be knocking down some planks, let's hit the one piece of grass that matters. So we'll come over here and we'll start our quest. Now, see that one's not getting power the way it should. This one is fine, and that one is blocked by a leaf. So we will knock down this leaf here. Last thing we're building up here, craft a storage basket. Oh, we need more clover and more woven fiber. Okay. There. We now have that to cook. Um, can we craft the woven fiber, or do we need to go find that too? Yeah, we can craft that. Inventory. Consume. Okay. And then we'll get ourselves a whole pile more clover, not like... Just knock it down and then we'll pick it up. Oh, 
get it. I know I can do the stem, but... They're usually part of the hit. Usually, I say. Okay. Back to our little spot over here. Oh, did I collect the... Uh, Sap from this thing today? Maybe from yesterday. Okay. Use the workbench. We'll make that. to come. Inventory. Equip. Equip. Now a lot of people don't bother with this at all. I think that's a mistake for two reasons. One, I'm going to need less food. See these icons here? I'll go through less food. And moist, I'll go through le with set bonus, means I'll go through less water as well. As well as it has um, where are we? inventory. A little bit of fence there, a little more. A little bit of fence there. So, all round, it's worthwhile. Like, why not? It costs next to nothing. Okay. Um, what else? Craft. Have I... I can't remember what I've made and what I haven't. I have not made the bow yet. Or the arrows. Did I make the spiky club? Yeah, I made the spiky club already. Craft. Rig bow. I made that. And arrows. Oh, might fuzz. Oh, right. Let's go deal with that. We have... Do we have a torch? No, we don't. We've got to craft a torch. Torch is on our bar. We'll put that in the end slot there. And now, um, oh, we can probably, uh, we've probably got stuff to analyze. We'll do that just before we go deal with the mites. Not enough things to analyze. So we'll just analyze what we got. Yeah, that may not have been worth worth it. Okay, where is the them. Is it down this? No, it's not. It's over here somewhere. Why 
Why am I not finding it? Oh, there it is. Okay, so there are some mites on the thing, but we will go hunting these ones first. Obviously not doing um, perfect blocking. I'm throwing my block way too soon. This is something you should really work on in this game, is get good at perfect blocking. And you can start taking on spiders and stuff. Perfect blocking means that you bring up your block just the last second, just as they're coming up. I suck at it, so don't look at me as an example of how to do it. Okay, so notice that if we have the torch, we can be holding this weapon, but the um, Ant club or the spiky club, both of those are um, two-handed weapons. So you can't have a torch in the other hand. Oh, look at this thing. It's so badly damaged already. Let's switch to the sphere. And I'll show you what we do about the fact that it's badly damaged in a sec. Yeah, I like the sphere as much as that other thing. I, I just like the extra ring. Because I am so terrible at getting in range on things. Okay, so that's taken care of. Let's break uh, one of those for now, so we got something to analyze, and then... Oh, have I made the hammer yet? No. Craft. Um, pebble hammer. Inventory. Pebble hammer. Six. I'm going to take out... I don't want to take out all of this. What's that? I don't know. I'm going to take out this one because there is a spot behind here. And I don't want to carry all the quartz quartzite on me all the time. I'd rather come back here and get it when I need it. I need the rest of it. I'll want it all probably sometime. But what we're looking for down here is this. The 
And that thing digging through the ground there was a grub. But we can't do anything about it till we can make the shovel. And to make the shovel, we need the air coins. We gotta go visit the oak tree to get those. Okay, so we're back at... Oh, I told you I was going to show you what we could do with that. Um, inventory... Oh, actually, no. Let's... You can repair it directly with that, or you can make a tool to do it. Can we craft that tool? Oh, no. To craft that tool... We're going to cut over this way, which should take us to the... Uh, Oops. Not over there. Over wow, here. look at the size of that Chunky Chubbs League approved baseball. It's the size of my baby boots. Even though it hasn't had the full time to uh, regenerate itself, at least the one will be. Yeah, it's full. That's what we really needed to do. Actually, did we need to do that? What do we need to uh, get the repair? Materials, workbench gear, workbench tools, utilities. I don't remember what it is to do the repair thing. Okay, so we can repair in a different way for right now. We can come here, we can right click on this, and we can repair because we have that quartz in our uh, inventory. And there we go. It's repaired. Oh, we don't need the uh, torch on us anymore. Torch is almost worn out. Really? We almost wore the torch just doing that? Okay, now for our next part of the story. We'll come over here. Press that button. Next cutscene. Take a look at the garden as we're coming up so you can see where everything is. The oak tree looks really close this way, right? <laughs> yeah, it seems further when you are as a little guy walking over there. Okay. Uh, let's craft ourselves a... Util storage basket. Or actually, did we do that already? No, we didn't. Sorry, what was I missing for the storage basket? Now, next major hint, don't put food in that. Even though the ants can't theoretically get up here, they can get at it. Even putting it up really, really high. Um, ants seem to be able to use telekinesis to get it. So don't put food in these things. You can put all sorts of other things in them. Don't put food in there. Oh, we are going to craft ourselves uh, tools, arrows. Now, 
how many, how much inventory spot is taking up four, eh? Right? Water again? Good grief. No. Bugs coming around to get us yet? Oh, do we have any uh, meat on us? No. Where the hell is that thing? I should set a marker over here. Still more on the other side. One little guy. Okay, let's set a marker for this. And that is under Utos. Trail marker. Custom colors, like it blue, water. So that will be, that'll also make it so that we can find our base. What's that doing? Must be a ladybug. Okay, so yeah, 40 arrows is more than enough. Um, I don't know what all I'm going to need on me. I don't know whether uh, ants want to eat that or not. That fuzz, I'm not going to need on me. I'm not going to need all of these things. So we'll get rid of that and that. I'm going to need that. I'll probably need that. Saps, maybe. Rigs, maybe. Yeah. Let's stick with this. Okay, great. Did, did I make a lamp? I don't seem to have made a lamp. Decor, plant lamp, dry grass. That's probably why I didn't make it. Dry grass. And that is number four. Try that again. Oh, Sam. Figures. Just grab the one I need. And they don't run out of fuel. All right, where are we on time? Time to sleep. Right at that second, as I said. Okay, I think that's it for this episode. Next time out, we will uh, go to the oak tree and play with all that stuff there. Hope you enjoyed this. And if you found anything useful out of what I did that you didn't already know from somewhere else, please let me know in the comments. Thanks.